Okay, hello guys. Welcome back to the channel. Long time no see. Yes, I've been really, really busy with real life. And I'm still doing something. Uh, I think it should be finished in one or two weeks. When it's finished, I'll show you guys and take you guys around to see what's been going on with my life. And for now, yes, I found a new game to play on. This game is called Azure Lane or Azure Lane or whatever you guys may call it. And yes, I've been loving this game. This game is somewhat a, a mini waifu simulator with uh, ships that turn into cute avatars. All of them are girls, so I could say uh, this game had a lot of grinding events and everything. And yep, uh, we just got out of maintenance and there are new events right now. So the first one is this one. This one is, I'm not really sure what the name of the event is, but there will be three new ships, which is Vampire, uh, Prince of Wales, and the last one is Atago. Uh, Vampire is only an elite, elite, uh, whatever. And the Prince of Wales is an SR. Um, those two can be farmed and also can be summoned through the building thing from this game uh, while Atago is only from the building ship so it's only summonable but the other two is farmable so that's what I'm gonna do this, uh, this time and I will try to do the event right now and uh, I think I'm just gonna uh, this one is the Prince of Wales so I'm just gonna skip this one and go straight into the event so okay, from this event, uh, you will be able to get a 5 star weapon if you complete the whole thing in 3 stars. Hopefully I can do that. And for now, um, okay, let's do the first one here. Oh, I don't have any battle ships or the squad ready for this, so I'll have to make one. Oh, okay, I thought I can bring the normal ones that I use usually, but I don't think it's possible. So goddammit, no. What? So okay guys, uh, this is kind of weird. Uh, I thought I can only bring my crappy units for this event. Turns out, no, it's not. So I'm just gonna bring the best that I have. Except for this one. Yeah, this one I can only bring maybe, yeah. Uh, for the first unit, I can only bring the crappy units. And for the rest of it, let's see. Let's give it a check. So, okay. Hmm. Alright. I'm just gonna bring... Uh, maybe Prince Yugen or the Takao but Takao is actually really good but I think for the first one okay I'm not gonna bring more I'm just gonna bring these four units actually so let's me let me try to recall this one okay ah nice I can bring two of my best one and one as the Vanguard unit so I'll try to finish this with just three units so let's do this oh formation requirements not met so both Vanguard and main fleet need to at least one character that means okay so no choice I have to bring this one let's try it again let's go okay I can do it now so I have to bring four characters on this one which I don't really like because the oil cost is gonna be a lot so yeah all right first battle I'll just put it on audit Alright, here we go. <laughs> As you guys can see, this game features a lot of cute characters. Really nice. And so far, I don't really spend much on this game. And I got pretty far. Well, actually not far. I'm still doing some farming. A lot of farming for some units. And yeah, okay, nobody got hurt from the first one. Well, the first uh, the first stage should not be that hard anyway, so yeah, this is supposed to happen. I'm not really sure. I think there will be like three stages for this event. And you can only farm for the Prince of Wales, I think from the third stage. While the Vampire, you can farm from the second, I think starting from the second stage. I think, I think, I'm not really sure yet, but it should, it should be like that. So okay, I'm just gonna have to fight a few more uh, waves until I see the boss, so I'll probably cut the whole thing until the boss shows up. Oh wait, that's it? No boss on the first stage? Wow, okay, I thought it was gonna be... Uh, like the normal ones where we do the quest and we fight a few waves until the boss shows up 
okay, so yeah, first stage, nothing big. I can bring my level 1 unit and it survives the whole thing. And in the end, it got to level 5. But that's not really important. Let's just check out now what do I need to... Okay, I can do this later because I need the 3 stars anyways in the end. And I just need to defeat 3 more escort fleets and that's easy. I'm not gonna do it now for you guys. And let's start the second stage. Uh, this one will give you an unknown unit, some blueprints, some um, uh, books to level up your uh, weapons and equipments. And a tier 3 uh, loot box for gears. That's okay, that's actually nice and some money. Okay, now we can bring, we can actually bring two squads. I'll just prepare it for the worst. So I'll just bring any of my units. I'm not gonna equip them with anything. And for the second, okay, second squad, I'll use this. And let's see what else I can bring. Okay, I'll bring this chick, Akagi. I just recently got my Kaga uh, last night, so yeah, not much yet. And for the second squad, I guess I'll bring this. Okay, yeah, I think I'll bring that. And for my first squad, I think I'll need, just to be safe, I'll add one, uh, another one more maybe, uh, firepower. But I'll probably just bring, uh, I'm not gonna bring the Takao, I'm gonna bring the Prince Yugen, because I want a little bit less um, oil cost for this so okay I think I'll still need to bring the level 5 uh, common unit there because it's the uh, requirements to enter this event so yeah I'll let it stay there okay story time I'm just gonna skip this okay now it seems like the second stage is actually the one that looks like a normal quest or anything so now let's start killing stuff on auto, this is what I really love about this game, everything is done in auto. Well, you can play yourself on manual, but I like it better when it's auto. And autos, the auto in this game is not so dumb, unlike other games, so yeah, I'm fine with it. Okay, let's see now on the first fight here. And will it actually hurt my characters? Well, I'm pretty sure it's gonna hurt me level 5-1, but... I'm not really sure if the level 5 character here, uh, since uh, she is the required unit to enter this uh, event, if she dies, I'm not really sure if the quest is gonna be failed or not. Hopefully not, because, yep, if, if it does fail when my common character dies, then I will have to level it up first. Which will take quite some time, and I hate that. Okay, the fight is now done. Hopefully the boss will show up and not somewhere on the map that is covered by a ship or whatever. So please, somewhere in the middle. Somewhere in the middle. Oh, nice. Okay, I'm just gonna switch to Fleet 1 and go for the boss straight away. That's so much energy wasted already. Okay, this should be the boss. Uh, defeat all enemies, all ships must survive and finish battle in 120 seconds. Well, so far, I finished the battle in 0, 0, 0, 0, which is the end of the battle. So far, hopefully this one I can finish within 3 minutes. Okay, so far so good. This is the boss stage. I think there should be something like uh, really scary or something that will damage my ships here when the boss shows up. That's usually what happens with all the quests that I've did, done so far in this game. The trash mobs are easy and then when the boss shows up, suddenly I got wiped. Annihilated. Or whatever that is. Okay, story time. Lots of papayas in this game. I like the personalities that they give <laughs> on this game. Okay, my level 7. Let's take a look at that. Hopefully she survives the, the barrage of fire here. So far she's not damaged at all. Which is weird. Usually... Usually it will die at some point. But so far? Oh really? That's it? That's it? That's it? Okay, second stage! Second stage is kind of easy. Okay, I got a rare character there, which is nice. Okay, that was easy and 65 gold. That's not bad. Definitely not bad. Okay, MVP is Hood, of course. She's my strongest unit right now. And now... Oh, 
Okay, then I'll have to do this uh, second stage one more time so I can unlock the third stage. So I'm just gonna cut through this and I'll see you guys when the third stage is open. Okay, finally I've done like two times of the second stage and finally the third stage is open. Now let's go in and try to do the third stage and we can farm the Prince of Wales here I think and if I do the three stars clear here I can get the five stars weapon for free which is what I really should do and I think I think I think I think just to be safe I'll bring another unit on fleet one I guess because I don't want to be failing on the first try here I'll just bring my Prince Eugen because I need the experience from this event as little as whatever they may give me on the experience but still I'm gonna need it and for second uh, for the second fleet I think I think I think I should just bring yes I guess uh, one more unit here just to be safe I know it's not gonna be effective on the oil cost but I gotta do what I gotta do I can't fail this event hopefully but if the level 10 common unit there dies and the um, event fails, I can say nothing as well. Hopefully it doesn't happen like that. Okay, story time. Let's just skip it. Okay, I'm just gonna start with the second squad and kill the trash mobs here. I'll probably just skip it because mostly nothing's gonna happen much on the trash mobs. So I'm just gonna skip it right when the boss shows up. Okay, so the boss <clears throat> will show up after the fifth fight so yeah uh you will need i think yeah for this one you will need two squads to make it more effective because you're gonna expend all the ammo you have on your other fleet and then you can start doing the boss with the other squad so yeah okay evade please yes oh i don't have to waste more oil to kill the ambush squad so okay uh yep from this one from the boss you have a chance a really small chance usually to get prince of wales because you see there a uh, yellow character in the frame on the loot table so yep okay please give me prince of wales okay and i will probably just do the three stars on my own later on because um it's not gonna be that hard you will only have to bring about what uh, two squads for everything except maybe for the first stage you can use your uh, crappy units on the first stage because it's really easy no boss you just need to kill some planes and it's really really easy okay story time and it should be the boss like really really soon Yep, it's the boss now it's Atago okay 36 layers of health Okay, I just, I just, I really just hope it doesn't kill my uh, level 10 unit there. Because I think, I think that's the main, I mean the flagship. Because if the flagship dies to any of these attacks, will fail. Hopefully not, not really sure. I just hope it doesn't happen. Okay, it's almost dead. Seems like really easy so far. Really, really easy. Yes, the boss is dead. Okay, that was easy. Like, super, extremely easy. Okay. Is that it? I guess that's it, yeah. Easy! Yep, it was really easy. Oh, no Prince of Wales. So I gotta farm more and more and more and more just to try to get the Prince of Wales. Hopefully I don't have to build it. But if I got it from the build, then it's okay too. Because if I have... Or uh, if I get the unit from the grinding here, from the farming here, I can still use it for a limit break. So okay, that was easy. Okay, she's now level 11, the common unit, and it doesn't die to anything, so okay. Yeah, that's the full event here, the three stages, and I will have to kill like 20 more of the escort fleet and defeat all enemies to get the three stars. I'll do it on my own later on. And yeah, that's the that's the event, I guess. And yeah, now let's check. I actually wanted to 
uh, build here. Okay, which one is it? okay? This limited build. So Prince of Wales, Atago, and Vampire. I actually wanted to do some summons, uh, maybe five or ten. But as you guys can see, I don't have the gold there, so I'll have to farm it. Uh, like really really fast and try to do at least five or ten summons but it's not possible right now so I'll be back uh, on another video for the summon may hopefully tonight or tomorrow cuz 15k gonna take quite a bit of time and I guess yeah I guess that's all for the event so yeah good luck with you guys on the event hopefully you guys get everything this event has to offer and if you guys are summoning for the new ships, good luck on that one too. But for now, I guess that is all. Thank you guys for watching. So I'll see you guys on the next video. And I really do hope you guys are going to try this game too. I am enjoying it a lot so far. So yeah, I guess see you guys later. Bye-bye.